Uh, peace and blessings. Assalamu alaikum. Shalawan family. Thank you for um, watching the video today. Thanks for tuning in. You know, on Wednesday, we had a full panel on um, the Doc and the Radical program. We had Sister Diamond. We had Sister Ellie. Sister Ellie is from the UK. And we were talking about how Bill Gates and the Biden administration is literally trying to block out the sun. We, we, we showed the report that the Biden administration did talking about SRMs. And how they were saying, yeah, you know, we know it's gonna have a, an effect on people, on the environment, we got to study it, but we have to prevent global warming because global warming is killing white folks. They were dropping like flies over in the UK when the temperature got up to 103. Black people over there was doing fine. It didn't bother them, but it, it, it did the cracker and they begin to die. We gotta understand, when they're talking about blocking out the sun, that will affect every living creature on the planet. When you talking about blocking out the sun, you need the sun to live. Now these demons say we can block out the sun and it'll help us live longer because nature itself has turned its hand against them. Why would nature turn its hand against them. It is because they are against nature. Will you speed up so I can get over? They are against nature. They are against nature itself. Their life is a disease on this earth. It's a deadly disease. And the earth itself says, your time is up, baby. You've caused enough havoc. See, you're, you're like the liger. They're like the liger. The liger is a, a tiger and a lion mixed. It's not natural. And so they can't birth more they have to make them in the laboratory. Because you came from the laboratory. You're not natural to the planet. And because we began to talk about this and deal with this in a serious manner, you two said, oh no niggas, we, we taking this down and we giving you a strike. They don't want you to know what's going on simply because it's the end of their rule and it's the beginning of yours. For them to take that video down and lie, said we were talking about COVID-19, ain't nobody on the panel mentioned COVID-19. But these demons, want to cut you off from knowledge that would help you sustain your life. And we have to be unapologetic. We have to be bolder and bolder and we have to keep talking about it. We have to keep raising the alarm. We can't give these devils a second break.
See, they're fine with you talking about Susie May and, and la la this and la la that that don't even goddamn matter. But you begin to expose what they're doing and what they plan to do. Then it's a problem. Then, oh, you 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 trying to be an unmanageable nigga. See what you don't understand, cracker. I ain't your nigga. I'm not the man to know the truth and then punk out and refuse to tell it. Punk out and refuse to pull the cover off your wicked ass. I ain't that man. I will do this. I will do this. Because this is who I am. You ain't going to punk me because you drop a video. You ain't going to make me run because you give me a strike. Because you terminate my channel. Like you did over and over and over and over again. And stop people from getting the notifications over and over and over again. Because we keep it 100. You not going to punk me. I'm on your ass. I'm holding the line. This is who we are. This is what we do. You're not going to find us running for cover. You're not going to find us trying not to have serious conversation. Exposing who your raggedy ass is and what your raggedy ass is up to. No, not here. We're black first. We're black first. This is your worst nightmare. So we're going to upload this video on Rumble. And the video is, is called I Am Death. The Destroyers of Worlds. What will the black man do? You go to Rumble, you look for that. Because I will upload it today onto that platform. I will upload it to Facebook today as well. Because you got to know the truth. Because these no good damn bastards are deceiving you. See, you got to understand the mind of this enemy. That you're going to go and block out the sun? You're going to try to put the gases out in the atmosphere that it can be so thick that it blocks out the sun. What do you think these motherfuckers are doing now? They claim that this, this uh, uh, fire in Canada that a, a fire in Canada is what's causing the smoke and, and, and the atmosphere to be different. But wait a minute. Wait a minute. Think, people. Our family in Philly, think. You got New Jersey that's right across the border. That's right across the way, over the bridge. They got wildfires and then they didn't affect your atmosphere. How in the hell can a goddamn wildfire from Canada affect the atmosphere in Philadelphia? No, that's them trying to block out the sun. That's what that shit is. Because they're doing this testing right now. Right now. Now, they're doing these tests to figure out how we can block it out with these gases. So you looking in like, ooh, that man, that's the wildfire. No goddamn wildfire. That's the damn cracker. Making his word bond to block out the sun. 
I said on the program, this Bill Gates nigga need to be done with. Need to be deleted. This dude goes in the laboratory and got two companies. And I'm going to post the name of them. I forget the name of them right now. But two companies that makes meat in the laboratory and the FDA already approved for it to be sold in your and my grocery stores. Lab, not cloned meat, not cloned meat, but synthetic meat that's made in the actual laboratory because it's supposed to save the environment. And the FDA has already approved it. So you may have this food, so-called food, synthetic food, already in your grocery store. Not real meat. And they're not putting a special label on it to let you know that this ain't real food, that this is synthetic beef, synthetic chicken made in the goddamn laboratory. They not telling you the real deal and you go in there and you're buying this food that's not food and you're eating this synthetic crap eating this clone crap and wondering why you dying of cancer wondering why your bones hurt these are scientists of immense evil And you should be tired of dealing with them. You can't afford to take a second break. You got to stay constantly up on the news. You got to stay constantly up researching this and looking into this. To find out what's the real deal. Because they don't want it to be known. But the cover is too short. We gonna pull it off and show you exactly who you dealing with. This cracker ain't your friend. They the bringer of death, the destroyers of worlds. This is who they are. This is their nature. And you better wake up and understand that they not your friend. They not your buddy. They are your worst enemy. And this is actual facts. But you look for the video on Rumble today. For the brothers and sisters that caught it live, you were blessed. And now we need to continue to spread it. So you get the link from Rumble and you spread it. Post it up on all social media. Because our people got to know. This thing is going down. And we got to do everything that we can. To save our own lives. Because these bastards. Are trying not just to kill us. But every living thing on the earth. Because they understand that they, they have a zero birth rate. They understand that their time is up. And our time is now. And their thing is, okay, yeah, we're going down. But if we're going down, we'll take all of you down with us. That's the mind of the enemy. You kill the nigga in you, I'm going to kill the nigga in me. And our God will reign supreme. We are black first. Today, tomorrow, and forever. Love you, family. Peace and blessings. Assalamu alaikum. Shalom.